everyone, welcome back to the channel, and today I have this week's pre-race roundup for the 2024 Hungarian Grand Prix. And I've got to be honest, there is not an incredible amount to go over this week. In fact, there's only really one thing, and that was announced only yesterday. And that is the fact that Kevin Magnussen will also be departing the Haas team at the end of the season, which means that next year Haas will once again have a completely new driver lineup um, of Oli Behrman and who we expect is going to be Esteban Ocon. Although that has not yet been confirmed, but it is looking incredibly likely that the Frenchman will be going to the American team for next season. Now, where does this leave Kevin Magnussen? I have absolutely no idea. I don't know where he's going to land, if he's even going to land in Formula 1. Because, as we know, when he last left F1, he left F1 completely. So when he left Haas last time, he was out of F1 for a couple of years. So where this is going to leave him this time, I really, truly don't know. Could he end up in IndyCar, maybe? I'm not sure. Because I know he was toying around there for a little while during his F1 hiatus, so we'll have to wait and see, but um, <laughs> for now at least, it looks as if we're saying get goodbye to Kevin Magnussen again. Of course, we do have now a couple of loose cannons on the grid, of course. Sergio Perez may still be in danger of losing his Red Bull seats, despite only signing a contract a few weeks ago. Of course, Carlos Sainz's destination is still unknown, same for Esteban Ocon, but it's looking likely that he's going to house, but again, that is nowhere near confirmed as of yet. So, Sergio Perez, I think personally, if he were to um, leave Red Bull, he would probably retire. As for Carlos Sainz, I'm leaning towards Mercedes for him. And for Esteban Ocon, as said, I think he's going to be going to Haas. But that's kind of all speculation. Of course, over the next couple of weeks, including the summer break which is only um, <laughs> coming up after the next race, I think we'll learn a fair bit more about next year's driver lineup and who's going to be where and who isn't going to be in F1 anymore. Um, so, yeah, that's going to do it, guys, for this week's um, pretty quick pre-race roundup for the 2024 Hungarian Grand Prix. So, please, like this video. Subscribe to my Nan Rock Sounds channel. Her link is down in the description. My button is down there. Please click those and then the bell icons to get both sets of our notifications. Comment as well, because why not? And let me know what you guys think of what I've talked about today. Where do you think Kevin Magnussen's going to end up next year? Where do you think Espan Ocon will fit in? Do you think he'll be replacing Kevin? And where do you think Sergio Perez and Carlos Sainz are going to end up? Because those two particular drivers are very hotly debated right now. Once you've done that too, please follow me on my social medias. They'll be down in the link tree in the description below. That is going to be Roxanne's website, of course. And lastly, please do share this video with all of your friends. They can join the infinite loop of liking, subscribing, commenting, following, and sharing, and around and around and around that loop. I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. Goodbye!